Hi guys and welcome to today's video. Um, this is a update video. We're back in the orange shrimp tank, as you can see. Back in the orange shrimp tank again. Orange shrimps everywhere. Everywhere you look, there's orange shrimp um, breeding really well. These guys still ignore that. It's just my little experiment trying to get some moss to grow. Um, so down here, the whole point of this video is I'm going to be talking about moss balls today. Um, and telling you a little bit about these moss balls, what you see in front of you. Um, when I purchased these moss balls, it was really small. Um, as you can see, this one here, for example, has come out absolutely brilliant. Um, so someone's asked me how I look after the moss and why it grows so well in my tanks. Um, so I'm going to be telling you a little bit about that today. Um, so when I first purchased these moss balls, it was really small. Um, hell of a lot smaller, probably maybe half of the size what they are now um, and all I've done is kept the aquarium lights on for an hour a day um, um, and that is literally all I've done and within a few weeks, maybe a month as you can see the moth balls have started to grow even these ones, these was all broke down um, as you can see, they're not as round as these because they was all broken down um, they've all started to grow even these ones here, the shrimps just sit on them and eat the algae off them. Um, and this is this little bit here is what I did yesterday. Put a little bit into a um, ring and tried to grow it up, see if it will grow. Just to use it as an example, so I will update you on this once it grows. Uh, so yeah, the reason moss balls grow so well in my tanks is because I leave the light on a hour a day, and. Um, shrimps just sit on it and eat the algae off it so um thanks for watching guys if you've enjoyed this video give it a thumbs up and subscribe and i will subscribe back thank you